Did you know, for example, we're one of the biggest salad growing areas in Great Britain? You, you learn something every day. Now, pop news and uh, former Hawkwind singer Robert Calvert has launched a project which brings the concept approach to rock music back with a bang. He's written a novel called Hype about the rise to stardom of a rock singer called Tom Marler. Released an album of the same name, subtitled Songs of Tom Marler, and takes the whole package on the road next month. So we asked Robert how his hype concept came together. Well, it started as a, as a novel about how the music business operates. It considerably exaggerated, I might add. It's meant to be entertainment. And as I had invented a rock singer, I had to, to make it convincing, invent songs for him that he'd written. And then I found I, I actually started hearing the songs in my head. And this led to composing the songs and recording them and uh, eventually releasing both the novel and the, and the album of the novel <laughs> at the same time. You say it's exaggerated, but you do know the world that you portray, and you portray a world where anything goes. I mean, well, yeah. like male violence, yeah. sexual corruption. How does the are we supposed to take it? Yes, um, I'd like people to take it as just a good read. You know, it's, it's entertainment, but in fact, it's about a world that exploits sexuality and it would be impossible to write a book about an industry like the music business without dwelling rather heavily on this subject. What do the music business make of it? I mean, have you had any reactions yet? Extraordinarily enough, all the reactions I've had from people in the business who read it is one of absolute delight in um, being portrayed in this way. In fact, a number of people, um, who I won't name, have actually laid claim to being the character that the sort of villainous hero of the book is based on, who, by the way, is an executive of a record company, not a rock star. They want to be Tony Khan. How much do you actually identify with the rock star in the book, Tom Marler? I mean, when you take these songs on the road, are you going on the road as Robert Calvert or as Tom Marler? This is a good question. Um, it's a fictional world, really, and how much I'm really buried in it, I don't know yet. I don't mind if I am, I don't mind if people actually believe there is a Tom Marler band, but the band, in fact, is a band called Bethnal, who were, in my opinion, one of, one of the best new wave bands, who didn't, unfortunately, make big news owing to problems with their management, which makes them an appropriate band to have used on the album, because that is what happens to the Tom Marler band in some ways, but fortunately, they've survived, and are still from the latest in concept albums,